New tonight, fresh life is coming to Greensboro. More options for food, fun and drinks are coming to downtown. Several new businesses are opening soon. WFMY News 2's Amber Lake stopped by one place celebrating its grand opening tomorrow. When you head to downtown Greensboro, it seems like you're always met with new bars, new restaurants, and even some new shops every other month. We'll get prepared because you're about to see a lot more of that as the city continues to fill their vacant storefronts. The city of Greensboro is on the right track. There's just a lot going on. When it comes to drawing people into the heart of downtown, new options for food and fun keep opening. I mean, like Jake's Diner here is going to open shortly. Uh, so we're going to have new dining options there. You've got Head and Gate Brewery. You've got Yokai, a Japanese experience, going to be on the north end. We have an Italian restaurant we're working with. We've got a Latin themed restaurant. These new spots have been posting all over their social medias ahead of their opening day, including Hidden Gate Brewing. This part of the town, the south end part, has you know only recently taken off and it's you know, with a vengeance. There's a lot going on here. I'm very happy to be at the intersection of the old Elm and the new uh, entertainment district. These new businesses opening to appeal to all the Gate City visitors. It's very interesting to me. We look at it from a data standpoint. How many people are visiting downtown Greensboro? Last year, we had 8.3 million people come to downtown Greensboro. And so we have ample room for more options for folks to choose. And so these restaurants are taking advantage of it. We couldn't be happier. In Greensboro, Amber Lake, WFMY News 2.